Hi guys, I'm Veronica. Together with my team there, I'm here in Spain at INTA, which is the Spanish Space Agency. This Friday, we will launch here our newest rocket called Stratos 3. With this launch, we will attempt to break the European altitude record for students, which means we have to go uh, above 32.2 kilometers. We've been here for almost two weeks, doing a lot of really cool stuff, preparing everything, assembling the rocket, doing some final testing to be ready for the big day on Friday. There's so much cool stuff happening here that I decided to give you a tour of our base so you can see how it is to be a rocket engineer in there. And now, I'm gonna show you the ultimate inside scoop, which is how we move around the base, because it's pretty big. We just scoot around. So this is the PR office. This is uh, where I work with my team. And uh, we're the ones making sure that you know all about what we're doing here. Uh, so what are you working on, guys? Uh, I'm writing a, a post about the, the electronics department, what they did today, uh, what they're going to do in, uh, in the days coming uh, to the launch. Cool. Yes, that is correct. OK, then I'm Hello. working with you with the mic. This is the office where all the big bosses work. So this is the biggest boss. Yes, I can you stand up? Uh, I'm quite tall with a big boss. <laughs> <laughs> Yesse is a big boss and he's actually the boss, he's the team manager. Okay, so now we're going to the electronics cave, which is where our electronics team works all day and all night. They're literally the biggest heroes of this launch campaign because they've been pulling all-nighters for two weeks straight now. So here we have this super cool piece of electronics. I'm guessing it's the flight computer, but if it's not, then Jos will tell you guys what it actually is. <laughs> it is indeed the flight computer. We are currently testing it and integrating it for uh, making it ready uh, for the Stratus 3 flight. Jill is here. Uh, we'll solder the last component of this PCB. Super exciting. Are we gonna go to the hangar? which is where everything is happening. This is the hangar. This is where we work on the rocket, which you can see here. It's currently not fully assembled, uh, but well, this is where the oxidizer tank is. And then over here, this is the engine. And here you have the fin cam, which will go onto the engine. Now I'm going to show you where we sleep when we don't work, which is right over here with our dare bear. Back to work! So we are here. This is our final destination. This is the launch pad. It's where we will launch Stratos 3 this Friday. This is the launch tower. It's 60 meters long. 16. When the rocket exits the tower, it will go at a velocity of about 100 kilometers per hour, which is already quite fast. But actually the maximum velocity that we predict Stratos 3 will reach is three times speed of sound. That's Mach 3, which is about 3,700 kilometers per hour. Well, this is my favorite place, the beach. Unfortunately, we don't get to come here very often, but that's because we're working very hard on the, on the rocket, so I guess it's worth it. So that's the last place I wanted to show you. This is it for our little tour. Make sure to check out our Facebook and Twitter for all the latest updates. And I'll see you on Friday at the launch of Stratos 3.